Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel and today I have some Lego Star Wars The Skywalker Saga news because there's been a new update and in that update is new content plus a couple of patch updates. Now all this information has come from the YouTuber Azatru who has just released a video on this not too long ago and from what I've seen so far he's the only person who's covered this so I will leave his video in the description for you guys to go check out. So he's going to go over the patch information and the new content, but I am just going to cover the new content because there's some big things. Namely, well, I say some big things, it's one big thing. And it's new capital ships to seize. And there are four of, four of them. We have a Venice-class Star Destroyer, of course representing the Republic, at which point you will have to start killing some more clones, as it appears to be an Order 66 era Venator. So that's fun. And just to add insult to injury, they're 501st Troopers, which hurts even more. Um, on the other hand, we have the Invisible Hand, the main starship for the Separatist Alliance throughout pretty much the whole Clone War, Clone Wars, until it was destroyed over Coruscant in Revenge of the Sith. So you can take over that one. Um, you have the Home One, which was the headquarters for the Rebel Alliance in Return of the Jedi, and lastly, the Fulminatrix, which is a First Order Star Destroyer. So we now have a capital ship for each faction of each era. And once you take over all of these ships, or any of them, you can buy it. Yep, once you take over one of those four ships, or hell, even the Imperial Star Destroyer, or the Resistance Starship, you can buy it to fly around for yourself. Which makes me very happy, because the Venator, plus those other three ships, were cut leading up to the game's launch. As if they tried to add them in, they would have had to delay the game again, which um, was probably a very big no-no for TT Games, as it would have been like the 60,000th delay to the game. So they probably said, no, release it now, we'll add it in after the launch. And that's what they've done. Will we be seeing other content cut from the game added back in? Who knows? Hopefully one of those is character customization. Because as we know, that's been a staple of LEGO games since LEGO Star Wars the video game in 05. This is the first one not to have it. So I'm hoping and praying to every god in the universe that they do, <laughs> that they do to that what they've done with these capital ships and add it in post-launch. Fingers crossed. Um, of course, as I mentioned, all this information has come from the YouTuber as a true. I'll leave his video in the description for you guys to go check out so you can check out um, some gameplay footage from the Venator class Star Destroyer. And his video will give you all the patch information for this new update released today. Well, yesterday for you guys. So that's going to do it for this little update video on Lego Star Wars The Skywalker Saga. So don't forget to like this video, sub, subscribe. To my Rock Sands and Frost's YouTube channels. The links are in the description. My sub button is down there. Yeah, that'd be great one, unless you've already subbed. Then it's great. Thank you for that, by the way. And once you've done that, don't forget to click all three. That bell icon to get all three sets of notifications. Comment as well, because why not? And let me know what you think of all this new content and which capital ship you're going to be aiming for first. I'm definitely going to go for the Venator just to get the ship and to get the clone killing out of the way. Uh, um, once you've done that too, don't forget to follow me on all of my social medias. That'll be in the link tree in the description. Um, don't forget as well to check out Roxanne's website and Frost's Instagram. That links are also in the description below my link tree. And lastly, please don't forget to share this video with all of your friends so they can join the infinite loop of liking, subscribing, commenting, following and sharing and around and around and around that loop. I'll see you guys tomorrow with another video. Goodbye.